In a meeting on Sunday, 27 Brexit-weary EU states agreed to forward a letter from the British Prime Minister Boris Johnson to the European Parliament this week for approval. The letter asked the EU to delay the date by which the UK has to leave the bloc. But Johnson has always insisted the UK will leave by October 31st without any delay, and crucially he didn't sign the letter. That deliberate ambiguity will be scrutinised by Scotland's top court this week to see if it broke the law. On Sunday, the opposition Labour Party argued that he had failed to obey the law. He's being childlike. The law is very clear. He should have signed one letter in accordance with the law. He's being childlike. And if... Well, was... I, don't, I don't think it'll happen, but if we crash out because of what he's done with the letters in 11 days' time without a deal, he bears personal responsibility for that. Stop. It would have been the case but Johnson's government is sticking to its guns. We are going to leave by October the 31st. We have the means and the ability to do so. And people who, you know, yesterday we had some people who voted for delay, voted explicitly to try to frustrate this process and to drag it out. I think, actually, the mood in the country is clear and the Prime Minister's determination is absolute. And I am with him in this. We must leave by October 31st. Gove also said the risk of no deal had increased and the government was stepping up preparations for it. Meanwhile, the tensions are rising in the UK as both the people and its parliament remain divided about what should happen next.